there's a new fitness mirror device coming out i mean my eyes rolled so hard has there been a breakthrough in abacus technology well, like what are we doing it's a little bit different in that you they have like a bar attached to this Ooh. so it's kind of like they're trying to like they're trying to horn in on tonal a little bit a little bit it's supposed to officially launch on kickstarter on december 3rd it's a, a new smart home gym and it's from a company called Aiki? Uh, I don't know how you pronounce this because it's spelled A-E-K-E. So the thing I thought was the most interesting about this Mm -hmm. is that it does not have a subscription service. That is interesting. This is the second new device in two weeks yeah that it one of its selling points the is, first one was hydro if anybody is wondering yeah you didn't listen to the last episode uh but that's the second time in two weeks we have a new device that doesn't have a subscription model it, it's interesting because that means one of two things you're either going to have a very limited set of classes right or you're gonna it's i mean it's basically like videos then right i'm yeah and so my thought process this is where my head went is because everybody now wants that ongoing revenue right and so i wonder if there will be a small number of classes that are free but then there will also be a subscription version so you don't have to get the subscription but like they will only slowly push out new content. And if you get tired of the content, you're going to have to subscribe if you want more content frequently. Listen, I don't know whether you're right or not, but I'm telling you this article specifically says subscription free. Interesting. I see where your brain's going. Right. That makes a lot of sense yeah, to that me. It, you know, almost like, I don't know, like cable, like, oh, here's something free. But if you want this other thing, you got to pay for it. Like, so we will give you content. They'll be creating content for the subscribers and the people that are free. They maybe they get that content or a third of that content uh, six weeks later. I also think that one of the things that you're paying for here is the AI attached to it, right? So if you say these are your goals, it's going to completely change up your workouts that it's giving you. So you're, it's kind of like Peloton's Strength Plus program, right? Um, which is going to take uh, AI and say, so you say, these are my goals and it, it makes a workout for you. But my question for all... All y'all and all y'all being Peloton Strength Plus, Hydro and this one, whatever, achy breaky. How are you going to help people progress if you like that's great that you can make a a, a workout. Right. Like I've seen what AI does for a program. It doesn't do a great job. It's it's not there yet. I'm not saying it will be there. I have no doubt. But it is not there yet where it can take into account your special needs. I don't understand how any of that is going to help people progress. Now, if all you care about is just a workout and you're not